What's up, YouTube? This is Lucky1313 bringing to you edition of How to Summon a Nat 5. Yes. All day long, every day in the channel, people ask, how do I get a Nat 5? What's the tips? What's the tricks? Well, here today, I'm going to show you how to summon a Nat 5. Most of you know who I am. This is the face to what you hate right here. Lucky1313. I'm leader of T1G. The co the founder, excuse me, not co-founder, the founder, the originator, the creator of T1G. Also, I lead EK. Yeah. But anyways, Unsorted's going to kill me when he hears that. Okay, look, this is how you summon an at five. I'm going to give you three simple steps. Three. Three simple steps guaranteed to get you an at five. The rest is on you, all right? This is how you do it. Step one. You see that right there? Money. Money is step one. Okay? You need either credit card or cash. Credit cards or cash. That is step one right there. You need money. Okay? Simple as that. You can be FTP all you want. Don't complain that you don't have a Nat 5 because you're not going to get it being FTP. You might. Some people say, oh no, Lucky. FTP players got all the Nat 5s because they've been playing forever. And, of course, to get an at 5, you get it from an MS Shore. You get it from a random MS. But mostly you get it from buying gem packs, whatever, blah, 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 blah. Gems cost money or time in the game. All right? You need money. Step one, money. Credit card, cash. Yes, I'm broke, so deal with it. All right? Step two. Step two. If you don't have money, you get money. This is how you get money, all right? People go around eating. What's the most expensive thing in your life besides gas, all right? Everybody needs gas to get to work. You can't cheap on that. Food, right? Food. It may cost you, what, $10, $15 a night to eat, right? If you eat three times a day, that's, what, $45? Breakfast may be 10 bucks for your, your heavy eaters. Lunch might cost you five, six, seven dollars. Dinner might cost you what ten, fifteen dollars. That's for single guys, single ladies. I, I guess that's the going rate. If you have a family, you go shopping, you spend two hundred dollars a month, you get your food, you stack it in your fridge, whatever. Da 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 da. Anyways, so let's say on average you spend ten dollars a meal. Correct. All right. Step two. Okay. Step two. Eat soups. Ten cents, thirty cents, tw whatever it costs in your store. It's cheap. Instead of going out and get your little McDonald's or Taco Bell or buying you a meal or a steak, you eat this right here. 10 cents, 20 cents, five for a dollar, six for a dollar right here. And look, you've already saved what, nine, eight dollars a meal? So now you have nine, eight dollars towards your next pack, right? Am I right? Am I right? I think I'm right. All right, so step two change your food plan. Eat as cheap as you possibly can be. Stop spending all your money on food. I know you got to buy gas to get to work, whatever. But change your life. You want an at five, you're going to have to change your life. You want to be something in this game, you're going to have to change your life. Right? Step one, money. Step two, change your life. I like that. So, step one, you need money. Step two, to get money, to do step one, start eating soups. It's good for you. Now, step three, after careful consideration and... Loads of research, scientific research, listening to players, how they summon, why they summon, what they summon, where they summon. Some do it on the couch, some do it driving to work, some do it uh, in bed, some do it in the morning, afternoon, a specific time on the clock. Uh, pop two Rainbow Mons, then pull an MS. Reset the game three, four, five times. Reset the lightning, da 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 da. I've heard it all. I've played this game for two years and I have heard every single myth, every single everything, anything you could possibly think of. Stand naked and summon, and nothing seems to work anymore. But one thing. So, step three. Step three is you summon 
right there. All right, you summon on the toilet. This is the summon throne right here. You summon on the toilet. Step three, summon on the toilet. I have heard all the stories of, oh my God, I've got such and such and I was on the shitter and oh my God, it works. Summon on the toilet. So step one, get money. Step two, change your life to get money. And step three, summon on the toilet. That is all. That is the secret to getting a nat five in Summoner's War. That is the tip, the trick, the secret. Nothing else, nothing less. Nothing more. That is it. Anyways, this is the face that I hate. Everybody hates me. Some love me, but everybody respects me. Shout out to EK. Shout out to Marine. Shout out to that one Gil. And a big shout out to Haley. I heard that your operation is going well. You're fighting the battle we all pulled together and hoped you would do. Fighting the battle of cancer. We love you. Haley, you're in our thoughts. You're in our prayers every single day. Hope for Haley. Anyways, that is my session on how to summon an app. Five, you, had, you heard it directly from the horse's mouth. Lucky 1313, leader of T1G Nation. Leader. Anyways, stay tuned for my next video on how to rune Galleon. You thought I was going to say an app five, right? Anyways, keep watching. Hit the like button. Subscribe comment, and stay tuned for more videos. Love y'all. Stay true to yourself.